I'm the Science Communications Officer for the ARC Centre of Excellence in Plant Energy Biology and my role is to equip the centre with the best ways that they can communicate the research that they do to the community. That means communicating cellular, molecular, genetic science, which has typically been quite tricky. It's a hard place to, to explain things to people and so virtual reality is now offering this opportunity to transport people inside of a cell. So what we've built is the virtual plant cell and we use this as a communication tool to take out to the community and transport audiences into the inside of a cell where they can actually explore and learn all about the research that our scientists do. Uh, I've brought with me a headset. You just pop a phone in the front of that, pop it on people's heads and they can look all around and learn all about what happens inside of a cell. I am a big advocate for a more scientifically literate community. I think it's great if the, the community knows and understands the science that we do. And I really think that's on us to actually, as scientists, science communicators, to explain science to people in a way that they can actually understand. And what better forum than in a pub over a pint? I'm not sure that I'd want to be anything else other than maybe a scientist. I, um, I used to be a researcher, but I found that I really enjoyed telling people about the science and having people understand the science rather than being in the lab doing it. And so I leave that to, to the guys that are enthusiastic about being in the lab and I like communicating. I'm not sure I'd want to be anything else. <laughs> Actually not much of a beer drinker, but I'm more than happy to talk about science over a lemon lime and bitters. <laughs>